welcome to the Let's Make Food from Food Kitchen. Today I am making sourdough English muffin breakfast sandwiches. Of course, I've made my own sourdough English muffins and Irish rashers. You'll find the link to those recipes down below in the description for those videos. My griddle is heating up to a medium low. So the first thing I wanna do is melt my butter and get that nice and liquidy. And we're going to toast our English muffins on the griddle in the butter. So while that's starting to melt, I am going to slice my rashers. And you don't wanna pre-slice this ahead of time. It can dry them out, and so you leave it whole until you're ready to use it. And of course, slice what you're going to use. So I'm just gonna do a couple of slices, and you can see how lovely that is. And this takes a little longer to cook, so oh, I wanna take a little cooking spray. I'm still tired, I haven't had enough coffee yet. All right, so I want to get those nice and crisped up, and that'll take the longest, so I'm gonna get those going. I'm gonna take my halved English muffin and get that started. So the next thing I wanna do is get ready to make my eggs, but I don't wanna start that until our muffin is toasted. Did you know that rashers came from Waterford, Ireland, like where the Waterford crystal comes from? The recipe was created by a butcher there. I believe it was in the mid 1800s. Yep, okay. So I've got those flipped over. I'm going to spray my table a little more. This is um, avocado oil. Ooh, that was messy. There we go. Have a little chop in my hand. So the egg is started. I'm gonna take just a little bit of my salt, and this is the Himalayan pink salt. And I'm also going to hit it with a little bit of fresh ground pepper. It looks great. Making this breakfast is quick and easy because all your prep work was done when you made your rashers and you made your sourdough English muffin. I'm gonna go ahead and get my plate ready. I've got a slice of cheese. This is sharp cheddar. I like all my flavors to be bold. All right, let's see if I can flip my egg without screwing it up. Beautiful. I've moved my muffins out of the pool of butter so that they'll continue to brown up a little bit more without soaking up any more of the butter. I think I've got plenty in there. Our egg will be ready here in just a moment. All right, so the last thing I'm gonna do is put my cheese on there and I'm going to put half of the muffin on there to help melt it. That muffin's nice and hot, so it should only take a minute. I'm gonna take the other half of my muffin, and I am going to put on my rashers. Nice and warm. And just plate it like so. That looks delicious. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you have a beautiful day. And from my kitchen to yours, let's make food from food. That's one bored puppy.